Hello and welcome everybody. Jean here with more Mars Anomalies and Artifacts. This time we're checking out ultra rare structures discovered on Mars. We're going to be looking at a new site in Nili Fosse and another in Melis Mensa. The anomaly in this IRIS photograph called Contact Between Parallel Bedded and Contorted Layers in South Melis Chasma was discovered by my friend Saturn Ark and as always you'll find links to the original source material in the video description below. This IRIS photograph was acquired on the 16th of July 2009 at a resolution of 28.7 centimeters per pixel. The anomaly that I'll be showing you was taken from the merged RGB color strip and uh, there's a look at the low res JPEG and uh, this color strip. Luckily in this one the anomaly we're looking at was in the color strip so we'll be checking out an anomaly in color in this one guys and girls. This site is located 11.17 degrees south 286.73 degrees east and it's in this location over here in Malus Mensa. And there it is, guys and girls, measuring about 40 meters across and about 20 to 30 meters wide. If we take a close up look, it uh, seems to consist of multiple blocks, slabs, or tiles of equal size. Check it those two over there very similar in size and shape over there to the one side we've also got megalithic blocks check these out over here as well and uh, look at the way they seem to overhang the opening over here we've got uh, rectangular dark spots over here to the bottom left I wonder if that there could be openings the second IRIS photograph I'm featuring in this one is called Mineralogically Interesting Crater Floor, acquired on the 21st of December 2006, up in the northern mid latitudes of Mars. Very unusual to find anomalies there, and uh, it's at a resolution of 28.3 centimeters per pixel. I'm showing the images are cropped from this huge JP2, close to 1.5 gigabytes in size. There's a look at the low res black and white. The site is located 24.67 degrees north, 74.67 degrees east. And uh, it's in this circular depression. We've got Ariana Collis here to the east and uh, Nelly Fosse over here to the bottom right. There the two structures are guys. We'll check out uh, this one over here as well as what looks like a huge block or perhaps an eroded pyramid. We can see two of the sides still intact very smooth flat surfaces and uh, that there's about uh, 40 meters across at the base with straight edges and right angles to this as well very similar to some others that I've found this is from our blog and video called strange triangular structure on plains and uplands east of Insight Lander and uh, this also fortunately was in the color strip there's another one also looks like uh, one side of a pyramid about the same size this is from the ancient Cerberus palace ruins of Mars and then this one over here this is a huge pyramid guys the capstone seems to be missing this is from Cydonia 2.0 a Mars MRO epic. George J. Haas also wrote a journal about uh, this pyramid and some other artifacts I found in this photograph. It's also been published on the Sidonia Institute website. 
the pyramid at the base is about uh, one and a half to two kilometers in length. There we can still see four of the sides intact. And uh, as I said, it looks like the capstone is missing. Got a smooth flat surface there. That's about uh, 500 meters, 300 to 500 meters across. And then the ruin of yet to the left, the rectangular slot of here is about 15 meters across. If we take a close up look, it looks as if uh, this is overhanging the opening underneath it. Right, there the two are side by side and uh, the rectangular slots or openings are very, very similar indeed. And then we're looking at uh, some megalithic blocks or slabs. It's almost like a monolith lying over there. That there is about uh, 18 meters long and about 8 meters wide. And uh, looks like there's multiple blocks or slabs lying next to one another over here. Got straight edges, very smooth flat surfaces, parallel sides over there. There the megaliths are up to the top. And not far from it we've got uh, another rectangular object over there. That there's about 8 by 15 meters in length. Got straight edges and a right angle there. It's almost uh, like sheet metal the way it's been uh, bent over slightly. It's got like a convex shape to it. And then this over here looks like an opening or a hole. That there has a diameter of about 12 meters. And uh, looks like something circular in shape is sticking out of the opening. Right, let's have a look at that anomaly my friend Saturn Ark discovered. And uh, it's in the huge canyon on the side of Mars in this region called Malus Mensa. NASA's photographed uh, this site quite a couple of times. 11 degrees south, 286 degrees east. And uh, there's the artifact. Nothing else like it in uh, this region of Mars over there. Right, then uh, let's go up to Nili Fosse in the northern mid-latitudes. And there it is, guys. There's a look at the JP2 we analyzed. 24 degrees north, 74 degrees east. And... Uh, there's a brief look at what I featured. Let's have a look at some of the other artifacts close by. This is from my blog and video called Stranger Things, Stonehenge. And uh, this was also in the color strip. We've got a row of uh, similar objects arranged in a circular pattern over there. Very irregular as well almost the same size and look at the spacing between those and then this is from megaliths at Nilocertus got that huge block you can see straight edges and right angles to it it's located in uh, this part of the photograph this is zoomed out check at the straight edges and right angle to that very smooth flat surfaces as well and then over here the 2020 Arova mission canals and uh, this is in Jezro that's it for this one folks thank you for watching I hope you liked it do let me know in the comments below what you make of these to my new subscribers thank you for joining I hope you liked my work and research Anyways, folks, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now.